Hello there, YouTube. Awesome Man Vapes back again for episode two of the Pre Made Wire Slash Coil series. Today I am going to show you Lightning Vapes Pre Made Clapton Wire Spools. Uh, these start out at about $10.99 per spool and they have an array of different Clapton configurations. Um, they, build, they sell the big three. They, as far as wire, they have canthal versions, they have nichrome versions, uh, stainless steel versions, and also a mixture. Um, they have fused claptons that have a nichrome core with like a stainless steel outer wrap. Uh, they have canthal cores with stainless steel wraps. Um, they have single core claptons, they have fused claptons, quad core claptons. Uh, it's, it, they have a wide variety. So anybody who's interested in picking this up definitely can check them out and definitely find a wire they would like to use. So here I have eh, a little piece of the fuse clapton wire. This is 26 and 36, normal fuse clapton. Um, so, and one thing I forgot to mention in my first video, what I review for these wires is cleanliness, um, how easy it is to wrap, and how springy it is. So let's go ahead and check this out. Let me move my chair so I can get a little bit closer to the camera. All right, I got a three millimeter screwdriver here. And just like any coil, let's give this a few wraps. Again, this is all Canthal, this version. And it's wrapping very well, actually. Not too stiff. Um, the right amount of softness. As far as how easy it is to wrap. And there's six. So, not very springy at all. Uh, once I got that six wrap on there, I just kind of did a little bit of this just to kind of make sure it all goes into place and seems to be very easy to wrap this wire. Uh, let's try this again. Let me put my screwdriver down and take another piece off here. So this does not have a spool tamer like uh, what Tofo's brand does, but it's, you know, to each his own really. So you do have to kink it up in this little groove right here. So kink and wire definitely, as we all know, is a pain. So let's try this again. Six wraps. There's one. There's two. There's three. There's four. There's five, and there's six. So you can see there, I got Fuse Clapton. Now I'm just gonna give that a little bit of a tug. And there you have it. Very moldable as far as the Canthal version. Uh, very easy to wrap. Good size wire actually. Um, definitely good for your standard uh, 24 millimeter atomizers. Um, but how's the flavor? Well, funny you should ask because I took the liberty of building some just before I made this video. So, there you go. Let's see if you guys can see that. It's not really wanting to focus, is it? That's no, not one to focus, but as you can see, it's wrapped very cleanly. Oh, almost got it there. It's wrapping very clean. Um, I got into the BTFC RDA by Aug Vape and Vape and Fagan. Um, I did six wraps on a three, installed them after the uh, dry burning and the wicking. It clocked in at an Pretty even. I don't know if you can see that. No, you can't. 
Yeah, there we go. It came out to a even 0 0.20 in resistance. So let's check the, out the vapor production and the flavor. So I'm going to back up my chair here for a second. That's at 95 watts. Flavor is what you expect from a fused Clapton. Very flavorful, flavorful, uh, very saturated. It is, it's good Clapton wire. This was all, this is a pretty good one too. Just like uh, the Watofo quad core, um, but a, I definitely give Lightning Vape still a little props on this one, mainly because. They have a huge variety of different Claptons of different uh, wire material. Um, like I said, they have all Canthal, all Macrom, all stainless, or a mixture of, of or a mixture of two of the three. Um, they start at ten ninety nine, like I said, uh, for a twenty five foot spool. Is that a good price? In my opinion, it actually is. Um, 25 feet of Clapton wire is a lot of wire. Um, I'm a novice builder. Um, I love building coils, but for anybody who uh, knows how to wrap coils and get them burning evenly, uh, uh, excuse me, this is this is a good way for you to get that nice saturated flavor and not having to have the hassles of building. Clapton's. Uh, if I rate this as far as like flavor, vapor reduction, and overall ease of wrapping and installing, um, I'm not going to do the 1 to 10. I'm going to basically go, don't buy it, check it out, or a definite buy. And if I figure out a way to fix that rating, I will. Um, but as far as this one, I would definitely give it a check it out because all I have is this one spool. So definitely a go and check it out. Uh, see if they have a fused Clapton that you would like, a cl fused Clapton, a single core Clapton or a quad core Clapton. See if they got whatever you like. Um, if you're a guy that likes all Nichrome, they got it. If you like all Canthal, they got it. All stainless, you know. Um, definitely worth checking out, uh, a good price, and really, all in all, I say this is actually pretty good. Overall flavor though, considering that, okay, for me, I love building low resistance coils. I love building a 0.08 to a 0.12. Normally I do like 24 nichrome with 36 canthal or 34 canthal. So I like those big beefy low resistance coils. They can pump an immense amount of power through it. Um, so as far as this, it's it's got pretty nice flavor. Do not get me wrong. But for me, it's not really pushing the heat, uh, the flavor, and the vapor production that I look for. Um, but for someone who likes to likes lower wattage vapes, you know, 75 to maybe 100 watts, 7500, maybe 175 to 90, 95 watts, um, if you're, or basically 100 and below, this could, I can see this being a good buy for you. Definitely go check these guys out, Lightning Vapes. Well, guys, this is episode two. I hope this uh, definitely encouraged you to go check out some Clapton wire in, in case you don't know how to build it. One don't want to go through the hassles. Definitely, definitely worthy of at least to check it out. But guys, that's it for this video. Monster Man Vapes signing off.